Oh, hey, YouTube. It's a beautiful day. It's about maybe 75 degrees or so. Nice breeze. We got some changes coming. Um, we're losing a car and gaining a new car. Well, when I say new, you know I mean new to us. So let's go check in with Brandon and see what's going on. Weed eating? Yeah, that's that's not what we're doing. That's for your work tomorrow. Oh. Doing a little car swap here. For a generator? Generator, a truck, for another uh, car truck. So it sounds good to me. So what's leaving? It's the old art truck. Because you remember when we first made the video about the art truck when we got it and had the clowns and all that? Yeah. Well, I said if anybody ever want to put this art truck on the road, you know, then, you know, I guess I'm fine with that. So, yeah, someone wants to put it on the road, so. Not a viewer, though, that we're aware of. No, it's not that, but... So tell them the story. I was at Starbucks in, the, in this little fair lane here, and uh, and the guy liked the car, and he said he had a, a Falcon, and uh, he wanted to sell or trade. And he was a Chevy man who saved a Ford. And I'm a Ford man who saved a Chevy, so we didn't know what to do with him. So, so he wants to put the Chevy on the road, and I'm going to try to put the Ford on the road. So we'll see what happens. I mean, it's been since 1985, so yeah, that's a that's a long time to be sitting. Yeah. So we'll see. But even if I can't get it on the road, I could sell it, or uh, it has the same drivetrain as this car, so I could have a whole extra transmission and motor. You know. You know that that's not going to happen. <clears throat> so we'll see what happens. You know, uh, but it looks like I could get a title for it and stuff. So that's what I'm going to do first. I'm going to get it here. It'll be here soon. And then uh, I'm going to work on getting a title for it. And then, uh, I don't know. We'll see if it'll run. How's that? Maybe maybe next next video, maybe after this one, uh, we'll see if it'll run. Okay. Yeah. You chasing birds again? Huh? You chasing birds again? What are you doing? You saying hi? Hmm? If you're new here, here's the truck we're trading. It's a 1956 GMC truck. We've had it for about a year or so. And when we first got it, people were like, you can't just have that as road art. So, anyway. It's not anymore. So that's good. Brandon lost a, a spring, so we're trying to to find it. He's weed whacking while we're waiting. Well, at least we didn't plant sunflowers. Looks like it's a goner. The spring. Well, it's gotta be here somewhere. You just gotta take time to look before it gets smushed. Found it. All right, so here is the swap we are doing for the GMC. It is, uh, I don't know what year, uh, Ranchero. It mm -hmm. reminds me of the Studebaker. Why? It's not burnt, though. I know, but like, I don't know. Just like the way it looks. Are you excited? Yeah. It's got, I'm going to miss the GMC, but...
We're always, always doing things at Solar Acres. Move my drive back up. It's probably where you put the gas. Or it's been hit. I think it's been hit because the gas is on the other side. That's so cool. That's so cool. That's how to drive, that's for sure. I know. That's great. Tail lights. You want me to do this? <laughs> yes, Are you dropping it on Wednesday? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> Do not undo both the front. Don't undo both? Leave one hooked up. I am under this thing. Alright, well, no, I actually got one undone. Oh, yeah. This is so cool. So here's the deal with this truck. Yeah. That, I, that I'm going to add to the deal. I want to know when you get it right. Okay, yeah, sure. I want to see you drive it. Maybe I'll see it in summer. <laughs> did you uh, did you uh, go in DMV? Yes, uh, the plate's not the same plate that I'm on the car right there. Really? Yeah, because I can notice it right now. It's not the same, right? But it says uh, 60 pickup or something on, on the really? car. Right? You got your chocolates on? Yeah, I got my chocolates on. Yeah, we're going to go through the back door. Okay. Yeah, we're going to go through So the guy was telling us, and I didn't get it on um, recording, but um, so it's a one owner car that he got at an estate sale. That's so cool. Hey, look, they got ladders. That's how they're going to roll it off of there. Oh, that's smart. Oh, the Mustang's so old. Oh, that's cool. Alright, do you think it'll go too fast? Uh, I think it would be lucky if we get to roll. That's what I thought, but I don't know. Look at this seat, it's perfect. It's nature's seat. I know. I've got a block right here, we brought with us just for this. Okay. Alright, we'll do that. I think this is what we did last time we did it too. Alright. Oh yeah. Perfect. There you go. Once we get a foot, another foot, it'll go. Yep, it will go. Here we go, right, right here. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Sorry, I don't like it. Not yet, you got a ways to go. Oh, there's the block. <laughs> Maybe I'll just put apart from that. something. Maybe yeah. I'll pull it out with the ramps. Well, yeah, I'm hoping. Yeah, it'll pull out. Put the block in front of the tire. Oh, yeah, that might work. But we need the block for the next one. I know, we'll have it. I got to put it in gear. Oh, okay. okay that's it, too. And I've oh, captured his eye. Okay, cool. Turn the wheel this way, Bill. That's why that's good. That's my house. 
All right, so now they got to figure out how to put the truck on there. I don't know how they're going to do that. Okay. Well, they got to load it first. Okay. They know what they're doing. Sourgrass. Yeah, sourgrass. You go up there? Yeah. Yeah, that's a pretty rough one, huh? Well, it used to be super easy, but everybody with their giant 40 inch tires and pulled the river up. Uh, the last time we went up last Memorial Day, nobody would cross the river. It was so high. He, he, went it. Oh, wow. and he actually had to pull me out the other side. Oh. The hill that we went up? Putting Shelby to work on the brake. It's not their first time. Pretty damn ingenious, though. This I would have got this one, but you know, it's really the funniest part of this.
Detroit. This is what the car has. Getting close to the fender. Okay, you better grab over. Yeah. Let it roll forward with it. You want me to move that block? There it goes. Oh shit, oh shit! Yeah, yeah, that's good. It'd probably work if you put a mask there and I bet you the brakes would come around because I pulled this drum off and everything's clean. Well, first thing I'll do before I do anything to this, before I think we're going to fit my name, make sure that it can go through it really good. Protect your investment. Yeah. All right, thank you guys. All right, well, thank All you right safe travels. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. I'm happy that's not just hard now. I'm gonna go to the split, like to go get a good video of it. Yeah, that'd be great. I mean, GMC looks cool factory, but the Chevrolet looks good at the hot rod. Yeah, it's a different truck. Yeah. All right, man. Probably still have a bumper though. Yeah, dude. Try to compensate. Whatever you can do. Thank you. Take care. Don't forget who I am. We won't. <laughs> All right, Bill. I got nothing to look at now when I come home. We saved her and we found her a home. Yeah? That's about as good as you could do. Yeah, hold on. Look at that, it fits right in like, like it's just been there the whole time. Go say hi, go say hi boy. Ewe, stop putting your phone on, look. Go get him boy. All right, so it's a 1960 Ford Falcon Ranchero. Okay, that's a mouthful. So in 1959, the Ranchero was a Galaxy, and it was as big as Phyllis. Okay. It was, uh, take a look, it was that big. That's it, our Ford truck. It was literally, it was literally like that big. And then the next year, they came out with a gas-saving car, and this is it. Okay, and it's a six-cylinder. Yeah. Three on the tree, this one. Yeah. There's a three on the tree. It's been sitting since 1985. 85, yeah. It has a lot of surface rust, but not a lot of Cancer. cancerous yeah, rust. The cancer is all right here. 
Uh, that makes sense. So, you know. Ooh. Oh yeah. So this part, but you know what? I could do hillbilly work on that one. Right. And then, and all this, look at the mosses on there. Oh, it came with extra stuff, look. Like Yay. Some kind of, oh, even a battery. Yeah, I'm look sure that, that works. I need a core. That's good. And, uh, what else we got here? What is... So the way it's bent right there, that's, that's... What's bent? The, the tailgate. That's normal. I don't know. The way it's curved sure like it that? It's normal, but probably not. Probably not. So yeah, look at 19. Come on, boy. 1985. Look, it's approved. Yep. Hey, hey. Get out. And the dog. Uh, the, uh, the dog. Ooh, the, that's the tailgate okay. got the bad rust here. Yeah. And, uh, so this could be the rust chero. Basically. The rust chero. Yeah. Okay. That could be what it's so we be. got bucket chero and the rust chero. Yeah. Ooh. No flipping way. Yeah. Yeah, but will it close? Wow, look at that. Oh. Look at Ooh, that. that's some bad rust. Where? Here? Oh. This is kind of solid too, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's solid and rusted out at the same time? This may have enough rust where you just leave it rust. I yeah. tell you. Look at that. It opens. Is that how you change the tail light? You have to unscrew that panel right there and then replace the bulb? I have no idea. That's, okay. that's kind of cool. Look at it. It has hooks you know i know Put your hooks on let's see if it's clean in here no let's see oh yeah pristine look at them floors That's look at them good. hubcaps see you're missing the the jewel babe oh man this got it's got it's got the mirrors oh my god look at the mirrors what man. the oh, heck black widows up on there that seems like way too big oh i see okay you tell me it's not a truck i still don't get it <laughs> What's that black part? I don't know. It's a bunch of things and shit on there. Get in it. Yeah. I don't What's that know. stuff right there? Heavy duty flasher? What's that little bottle? It's a flashlight. Look at that. That is a flashlight. What's that little bottle? It's pills. <gasps> oh. It's some, uh... Some old aspirin. It says bear on the cap. Oh my god. It's an old aspirin from 1985. Oh my god. That thing is probably like... Oh my god. Don't shake it. It could be volatile. <laughs> We got shades in here. What do we got here? Oh, oh what is that? They were glasses. Dude, they, they disappeared. They disintegrated. They disintegrated. Look at the lenses are still in there. Oh my god. Don't breathe that stuff. That's how long it's been sitting that your glasses will disappear. <laughs> yeah, that's how long they've been oh. sitting. But yeah, look at this score. Oh, dude. oh wow, those look are at, nice. rusted too. Look. Look at this. I think this is just this might be beyond. Look at that. Oh, man. How do they go on? Huh. Oh. The tire has a hole. <laughs> Needs a little air. Yeah, so it looks pretty Oh, cool. there's some rust on the door, too, forming. Oh, yeah. It's, it's pretty crispy, dude. But you know what? I mean, the engine bay doesn't look, you know. It has all its parts. You know? The fact that it has all its parts is a big deal. What the hell is that in there? Yeah, it's got all its parts. What is all this? Extra? It's a uh, trim. Oh, shit. I'll have to cut that with wire cutters. Oh! <laughs> they thought I had my glasses oh, on. Oh, no, it closed and now it won't open. Shit. Maybe it's this. Maybe it's locked. Let's see. Oh no. It was opening, but they didn't oil it, I bet. Well, maybe once you start with your handy dandy WD 40. I don't think so. Don't We're not. Uh, I don't think that's going to come around. Shit. Well, you're just going to have to duke the hazard it, man. Oh no. That's not good. Funny story when I first met Brandon, he had a 1986 Ford Mustang. And what, why didn't the door open? Bad alarm system. So I had to get in uh, through the window. But when I first got in, I ha when I first when we went on our first date, I had to climb in through the driver's side, oh, through the back. I wish they didn't. I wish they would oil it first. Damn. Oh, that's the first thing that makes me upset. How's the rust here? What's this here? 
got growing moss or something? Yeah, this side's better, huh? Yeah, look, it's got full-on moss you pockets. Think the gas good? Oh. Poof. Oh, yeah, right. Oh. She is straight out the field fresh. Holy cow, man. All right, that's fine. Well, it's here. Mm-hmm. You know. And what's this little thing for right here? That's to open the keyhole. First year they had that. What? One. Yeah. So it gives you extra shit to do. See? Oh, wow. Yeah. Man, what a bummer. That's a hassle. I have to, like, pay a shop to get that open or something. Little Windex will be good. Yeah, it's not that bad. It's got a big old crack in there, but it's not the worst crack. Oh man, that's like... It's just years and years. SOS paddle deal. These aren't too good. No. I still haven't replaced them on Phyllis. You gotta earn your keep to, to earn wipers. I almost want to throw a wrench on it, but I got other stuff to do. I'll do that during the week. During the week, I'll see if I can get it ready to, uh, to fire. You know? It's got weird parts like this. This fuel pump's weird, and uh, the mass cylinder's weird. Uh, and positive cable's not so good, so that seems that. Generator's there. Exhausted all this. The R is there. Oh, it's got a holly. What? No flipping way. Wow, that's good stuff. I bet it's got a big carburetor on it. Let's see. Oh, you know why? How you know? Look how where the hole is. Mm -hmm. It's to the front. That's for performance. Ooh. Yep. That gives you what? Two horsepower? I don't know. But will you come off? Probably not. Let's see. What in the world? What's oh, that is, funny little thing? What is this? This should come off. It should, but... Oh, is it screw on? Yeah, there you go. There you go. Keep working it. Lefty loosey, righty tidy. It's been too long. Or what are we dealing with here? There's a little screw right there by your thumb. What is that little? This thing. Yeah. I don't know what that is. It's a the lever. It's a flux capacitor. <laughs> this thing's got to go, or something. There you go, and then pull it up. Like, oh, you're gonna break it. You know, like turn it and oh, pull. Oh, it looks like you pull it. I'm gonna have to watch a YouTube video about a 1960 car. Come on, man. I say we leave it alone. Okay. For now. Because it's not listening. It's a holly, though. That's good. A little holly. It's a slant, straight slant. What straight, is it? I don't know straight, what the difference is. In. Slant would be crooked. Okay. And straight. Duh. Yeah, she. Okay. She she exists. So now, so now you have a 1960 Ford Ranchero. How does that make you feel? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. Oh, uh, no radio though. There's no antenna. Got a radio in there? No, there's no antenna. You don't need an antenna, man. You put your uh, your iPod in there. You put the party speaker in there. Yeah, I don't know. This car, this car may be. Maybe too far to clean up. What? Well, I can clean it up, but I need to paint and stuff. Like, find it or anything. I don't know. It'll be, it'll be cool no matter what we do with it. It's going to be cool. Yeah. Well, I mean, it blends in. Yeah, you almost can't see it. No, I mean, like, with all the other cars we own. Oh, he rolled this window down too. I wonder if that messed up. Let's see. Oh no, it's, it's working. Now try to open it. Yeah, that worked on cover the whole time. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, well. I guess uh I guess now we got something new to look at and mess around with and content. Yeah, you know, I'm not in a rush. You know? Right. I'm going to try to get a title for it. And... All right, well, 
don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see whatever we decide to do with it. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah.